guys, it is Nick the Booksmith, and I am here to share with you the latest project. This is the journal of Sarah Ann Collins, and she was orphaned at the age of 16 when her when the ship her father was sailing on to come home um, went down in the Atlantic. And so she is being sent to an aunt who has... Um, who lives in Philadelphia but wants nothing to do with her. And so she um, has created this journal in order to um, vent and write down her thoughts and that kind of thing. But she doesn't have a lot. Her aunt, although she is wealthy, will not give anything to Sarah Ann for anything other than room and board. That That is it. And so this journal has been um, pieced together from remnants of clothing and uh, broken jewelry and an old book that she found that she was able to salvage. So it's done in it's done in this deep uh, I guess it's a I guess it's a teal. It's like a deep oceany teal with um, copper embellishments on the front. We've got the raised sections here. On the back is a little fern leaf. It's also gilded. All the edges are all gilded. And then on the spine we have a key, a little Tim Holtz key, and we have a heart from um, her mother died a long time ago but she still has this. It was a a piece of her mother's jewelry that she's attached onto there. And then instead of, I can't get a hold of it, instead of wrapping the ribbon this way, I created a little, a little um, eyelet here with this little ring so that um, it can be easily taken off. But I still tied these, this beautiful, so this is silk ribbon, this aquamarine, and then this is seam binders ribbon up here. Of course, the cheesecloth that is um, reinforces that spine and the closure is this ribbon so oh and look at all the tails man this sucker is all sewn together and it's a mess i hope you like it so let's see here am i too close is my camera having a problem okay i'll try to just not move it a lot and just keep it keep it there okay so inside is this script um, cardstock paper there um, the pages are done in this coppery color and this teal oh, cold um, down here is a little um, train ticket that has been sewn on and there's a piece of um, old cotton and a pin it's one of those Tim Holtz pins and then there's a photograph right here when she was a little girl it's a picture of her when she's a little girl there is some extremely old sheet music lots and lots of these um, you know those things <laughs> those things book pages and pattern paper here is an envelope all sewn all that is a pain in the butt all the way around sewn all <laughs> And then on this side, I put some different textiles and this little garment pin with a little dove charm. Journal cards, of course. More little uh, journaling. You journal on the back of that. Some ephemera. There is a um, postcard. Here's a sewn pocket here with the tracing paper ruffle more book pages and graph paper oops there's a shipping tag here with some flax twine there's another piece of ephemera here and then one here in this sewn pocket some stamps and some cheesecloth down here and then this this is a peekaboo pocket and then this is also a little slip spot too 
On this side we've got this um, sewn pocket here with a journaling page and a piece of ephemera there. More sheet music, ledger. This is a flip open, but it's also a pocket in the back. Another shipping tag. Another piece of ephemera here in this sewn pocket. It's got this dirty looking muslin cotton with this little pin with the beads on it, the gypsy bell. And this side's a little tuck spot and peekaboo pocket with some of that muslin here. This one is more than 160 pages. So I had it all stacked together, but there was one signature that just didn't feel right. And so I added a few pages to like, to even it out in my brain. <laughs> it just, it didn't fit with the others, if that makes any sense whatsoever. So this one is a little bigger than the 160. It's probably like 165, 166. A piece of ephemera there. That was from that, um, no, I can't remember, K and Company, maybe, ephemera pack. There's some more of that neat stuff. No coffee grounds. I don't know. I don't know, people. Um, there's a little journaling card pinned into this pocket, and then there's a peekaboo pocket on this side with one of those postal telegram receipts. There's a page from her mother's favorite book pinned into this pocket with this dirty muslin and the, and the uh, cheesecloth. And then this is a needle, the front of a needle book. Some more sheet music, ledger. A little ticket up there. And then here's another uh, sewn in tuck spot on this page. So this one is going up on the Etsy store today. Um, I hope everybody's having a great weekend. And thank you so much for stopping by and checking out um, this journal. And I hope you like it. And um, yeah, I guess that, I guess I guess that's it, man. <laughs> I guess that's it. You guys have a good one and I will catch you on the flip side. Bye guys.